Hi, I'm Bill Moylan, and I'd like to make your employees more productive and effective with my unique program, Professor Moylan's Workplace Essentials. It's a unique combination of in-person seminars at the workplace and self-viewed online video webinars for employees to view on their own. It's an all-in-one format. Everything is included. You choose which modules I'll present live in-house, and I motivate your employees to follow up on their own with online webinars, which can be viewed at any time or even listened to in audio format. Let me start by introducing myself. Right now, I'm an adjunct professor at Nichols College and have been since January 2014. Before that, for 12 years, I was a full-time lecturer in the College of Business at the University of Hawaii. Prior to that, for almost 10 years, I was a full-time seminar leader, and I've got a lot of real-world experience. I was a corporate manager and executive for 15 years with companies including Nestle Foods, H.J. Hines, and Clorox. I have my MBA from the Tuck School at Dartmouth and my bachelor's from UCLA. Your employees get a great in-person workshop, proven practical real-world concepts and applications that they can use right now, and motivation to view the online webinars on their own. What they don't get is a lot of hoopla, blustering pontification, which is so common in a lot of workplace training. And you don't get a whole lot of over-promise and under-deliver, which is also way too common. Now, here are the seminars that are offered. Essential communication skills. Essential business writing skills. Time management and organization skills. Delivering excellent customer service. Finance and accounting for non-financial managers. Working well as a team how to stay motivated. And remember, your employees get everything, whether it is live or online. Everything is modular, so you choose the live in-person components. Now I'll go into detail for each. Essential communication skills. I start with the basic communication model and get into those receiver skills of listening and reading and those sender skills of writing and speaking. Of course, this can be customized to focus a lot more on business writing or on effective speaking. There are a number of specific communication content modules, so it can be customized for your needs. In fact, in the past, so many want specifically business writing training that I have to give you those content details. Essential business writing skills. How to write the three-step approach. Should you send an email or send it as a memo or a letter? The most common grammar and usage mistakes. That sounds kind of boring, but we actually have a lot of fun with that. We start with a little quiz, and people see the things that they typically have mistakes with. Editing for power, formatting business documents, what the common business documents are, and how you shouldn't reinvent the wheel every time, how to use templates for efficiency. How to stay organized. And this, of course, includes time management. Manage your time for peak productivity. How to manage multiple priorities. How to keep your files organized, including your electronic files. And organizing your physical world to get all that clutter out of there. Delivering excellent customer service. We'll get into customer service norms. We'll talk about how the customer is not always right, uh, but don't let the customer know that how to build rapport with customers, controlling the customer interaction, how to deliver negative information in a positive way, and how to stay customer focused. Finance and accounting for non-financial managers. This clearly is not a program for a lot of workplaces, but some employees benefit greatly from having a little bit more understanding of these issues. And so in this program, we get into the accounting process, how transactions work up into financial statements, what those mo major financial statements are, the income statement, the balance sheet. We get into the basics of ratio analysis and budgeting. Again, like the communication program and every other program, this can be customized to your workplace's particular needs designed module by module. Working well as a team, we'll get into the value of teams, leaders and member roles, different types of workplace teams, 
turning dysfunctional teams into effective teams, we'll get into the mechanics of team processes and why it's oh so important to clarify team member roles. How to stay motivated. In the past, some organizations have asked me to come in and rally the troops, get people excited, and so on. At first, I was quite reluctant because so many so-called motivational speakers are so much like this guy, my favorite Chris Farley character, Matt Foley. This is not at all what this program is about. In the How to Stay Motivated program, we get into setting appropriate goals, tracking your progress towards those goals, having the right mindset, how to stay inspired, why it's important to take breaks and don't be too hard on yourself, and how to break your tasks into manageable pieces. Where did this all-inclusive business model of mine come from? Basically, it came from my past seminar industry experience, a book called Sham, and my somewhat unique college classroom teaching model. In the past, I've delivered seminars for the American Management Association, which is an excellent, excellent organization, National Seminars Group, which I did some programs for on a contract basis back in the late 1990s. At the time, I thought they were the best one-day seminar company. Some of the other one-day seminar companies are, in my opinion, not that great. I also worked with Microsoft's Transpoint.com unit as their exclusive customer service trainer for new North American partners. Sham, How the Self-Help Movement Made America Helpless is a great book, in my opinion. It points out some of the real problems in the speaking slash training industry, especially in the personal development area. I avoid those pitfalls. My relatively unique college classroom experience is what really gave me the idea for this, in that I could take the methods that I use in my college classrooms and apply them to an organizational setting. Here's a screen capture of my spring 2016 introduction to marketing class. As you can see, for the chapters I put online for my students, online videos, audios, and audio describing key terms so that my students can absorb that information on their own prior to when we get together and discuss it in class. Here you see the first five chapters, but it, it's identical for all 21 chapters that we cover. I started using this method at the University of Hawaii. I was trying to teach accounting to people who are having a lot of trouble with accounting. Rather than just repeat myself again and again and again, what I did was I put together online learning modules and told them to view them several times until it really sunk in. I learned that this was a great way to get that information across. I wondered why you know, can't I utilize this in an organizational setting as well? Uh, do participants like this? Well, my college students certainly have. Here's a screen capture from Rate My Professors from the University of Hawaii. As you can see, overall quality is 4.8 out of 5, 4.8 for helpfulness, 4.8 for clarity. These were the highest scores for anyone at the College of Business at the University of Hawaii. Here's a couple of student comments. I'd have to give a grade to Moylan. It would be a big A++++, just like the others say about him. He's the best teacher ever. Best teacher and love his way of teaching. I learn a lot from him. Take him for any class. The comment from the top is from Biz209, which was a business communication class. The comment on the bottom was from Marketing391, which was a competitive strategy uh, class. Here's more recent uh, feedback. I did a survey from my fall 2015 Nichols College students. 84% uh, they would definitely or probably want more classes with online video and audio content like this one, which was that Introduction to Marketing or Principles of Marketing class. Now, do corporate participants like this? I don't know yet. I've actually never done this all-inclusive model with organizations before. But in the past, for my in-person seminars, I've never been asked for a refund from a corporate customer. For those public seminars where participants give a critique, my public seminar dissatisfaction rates were less than 0.5%. That's significantly less than the industry average. And I have corporate references, of course. For you, this is completely risk-free. There's a 100% money-back guarantee 
and you can preview the online content in advance to determine if you think this might be worthwhile for your organization. Now, that's the main program. I also have another program that may not be it for everyone, but for those organizations where you want employees to have a basic overall understanding of what business is all about, I put together what I call the One Day MBA program with modules in finance and accounting, marketing and sales, customer service, operations, business planning, and strategic planning. And of course, this is modular. So you can decide exactly which modules you want, which ones you want more of, which ones you want less of, and so on. Next steps, I'd like to talk with you about your organizational training needs. So please give me a call. My phone number is 808-542-1525. Again, that's 808-542-1525. Or send me an email at wmoylan, W-M-O-Y-L-A-N, at hawaii.edu. My website, www.billmoylan.com, is not active yet. I'm still putting together some of the final touches on it. Because of that, early adopters, those organizations that I work with right away, will get a 50% discount. That's in keeping with my practice of aiming for very satisfied customers. In the past, I had a lot of repeat business and a lot of referrals from very satisfied customers. My plan is not unlike packaged goods marketers who offer the introductory discounts to get people to try a product because they know they'll come back again and again. So please give me a call or send me an email. I look forward to talking with you about your organization's needs.